That's right. LAPD is still here on the scene almost 15 hours after this all happened. And this was no ordinary burglar because most car thieves or burglars steal something and make a quick getaway. This guy just sat inside the off-duty uh, police officer's car wearing his bulletproof vest. Take a look at the suspect because the investigation really centers around this man. The LAPD has not yet released his name, but they say what appeared to start as a burglar ended in a running gun battle with this guy. It happened at 225 yesterday near Magnolia and Van Nuys. The off-duty officer went down to his personal car, and that's where he says he found the suspect sitting inside the car wearing the officer's bulletproof vest and armed, police say, with the officer's gun, which had been inside his work bag inside the car. The officer had a backup gun on him, confronted the suspect, who at one point began shooting at the police officer. The officer shot back, and suddenly you had a running gun battle through a subterranean garage and onto a walkway, ending when the suspect collapsed. Now, the officer grabbed his gun back and went back inside the garage, garage where he, too, collapsed. He had been shot three times. He was rushed to the hospital and straight into surgery. Uh, from what started out as a burglary or what started out as simply a theft into a vehicle uh, and the, so the senselessness of this escalating to this level of violence is really just it has me ex extremely troubled in the concert of when you see the other violent acts that we have going on around us. Now, the police officer is out of surgery but remains hospitalized in serious condition. We're told his road to recovery will be a long one. Again, he was shot three times. The suspect was also shot and remains hospitalized. Again, his name has not yet been released. But sources telling us right now the working theory is that this was a transient. And again, not an ordinary burglary burglar trying to steal something and make a quick getaway. This guy was actually sitting inside the police officer's car with that bulletproof vest on. Reporting live this morning in Sherman Oaks, I'm Gigi Graciette. Back to you in the studio. It's a good thing other people didn't get hurt if they were having a full-on shootout there in that parking structure. Yes. All right, Gigi, thank you.